Hello guys, it is Rocks Life here today. I'm gonna to be telling you guys 10 things that has happened to every single Deep Oaken player. Don't lie, this has happened to you. You know for sure it has. Don't lie to me, don't lie in the comments. You know this has happened to you. First thing that has happened is, you know when you know you're just fighting something and you're at low HP and out of nowhere, a mother, a nigga just come out of nowhere or a void walker just start attacking you and now you're put in player combat. So now when you knock the thing that you're fighting, then you can't get an HP pack. That's most definitely happened to you. You know, you're low as fuck and then a nigga just come at, come at you and now you're done. You know what I'm saying? That's the most definitely happened to you. And I know, and I know damn well you raged after that happened to you. I know damn well you raged. Second thing that has happened to all deep Pokemon players is when you're farming and you finally get something good in the chest, but then a dumb nigga decides to take it. Lord, the amount of times this has happened to me is crazy. Like, this is gonna happen to you today. Sorry, I don't I don't wanna wish it. I don't wish it on you, but it's like it's gonna happen. You know, like deep Pokemon players, they don't care. They just don't care. They don't have no feelings for you. They don't care what your how your day is, like they just don't care, you know. They ain't, they're not friendly, man. They're not friendly, man. They're just going to steal your loot, be thugs, be the thugs they are. And yeah. The third thing that has happened to all Deep Oaken players is when they open a chest and they see a three star, you get hyped, though. But then you, it is the worst three star ever. The worst ever. Like, I be swear, like, I be getting a three star Iron Singer. But then that shit's 42 Ether. Why? Why are you 42 Ether? For what? Just don't give it to me, bro. Like, what, 42 ether and it's a three star? Nigga, I'm trying to get like 30 HP, drown, three star, 20 DVM. Like, let me get that. Let me get that, bro. Like, just don't, what do you, I'm like, what are you doing, Archmage? Why are you giving me that trash ass three star for 42 ether? I don't want an ether king build, bro. Don't get me that shit, man. Damn. That's really how I be feeling, bro. Like, that's just sad. I really feel bad for people that, but did you get hyped for no reason? Fourth thing that has happened to everybody in Deep Oaken is you can be in the worst situation possible. You can be in the depths getting ganked. You can be getting attacked by a corrupted King Thresh. You can be, you know what I'm saying, layer two doing a theory on, you know? You can be fighting Chaser. But then you just end up crashing. Oh my gosh, this has happened to so many people. I've seen, like, I've just seen so many videos and I've just been just so sad. It's been so sad for you, like, I just, I just wanna just give you just a hug, man. Cause you deserve one. Cause I just feel so bad. Like you were in the worst situation ever, ever. You just crashed. Like, why you gotta do me like that Roblox? Why you gotta do me like that internet? Like, why you just gotta do me like that, man? Like, why you just gotta do me like that? Please, just just let me finish what I'm doing and then make me crash. Bruh, I don't care. Like, just let me get out first. Get out the situation, then I can crash. You can break down my whole computer. You can break down my whole piece. You can break down everything. You can destroy anything you want. Just let me get out the depths. Let me get out my situation, please. The fifth thing that has happened to all Deep Pokemon players is dying to Rax Live. Everybody has died to Rax Live, no doubt about it. Everybody has got ganked and absolutely lost, boss rated, absolutely lost when it comes to Rax Live. Rax Live is the number one player in Deep Pokemon. We all know this. I'm not lying. It's, it is pure facts. It's pure facts. You know, Rax Live is the number one Deep Pokemon player. And we all know this. He has 8,000 ELO. But like I said, Archmage has kept my shit secret. And I'm gonna tell him to stop keeping my shit secret, man. Everybody needs to have 8,000 ELO. Rax Live is the number one player. Everybody has died to Rax Live. And I feel bad for anybody that has died to Rax Live, you know. I ran into him in the game. He's making my shit 5-0. I didn't win a single match against him. And that shit ruined my day. And I, I quit Deep Pokemon for 30 days. The sixth thing that has happened to all the Pokemon players is getting hit by the meanest combo by the monsters while doing Hell Mode. I begin, that's how some of my builds be wiping. Like, Hell Mode is very scary. You get hit with the meanest combo. Like, for some reason, like, just for some reason, the monsters decide to team up and be team players and decide to make up a combo out of nowhere. Like, the Lionfish Sharko kick up in the air or the Thresher kick, the Thresher thing. The Thresher Barrow up in the air, and then the Lionfish decides to hit you with a laser. Like, they just all do the little, little teamwork move. Like, shit. Like, I don't know who did, but like, somebody over there turned on Team Takeover. You feel me? Like, I don't know why they all did just decided to be so good or whatever. The seventh thing that has happened to everybody in Deep Oaken is when. You just run into that one BS build in time. Like you just run into that one mage boy, the person that just runs, the person that uses the storm as an actual playing style. Like you just run into that one player. 
that just ruins your day and just ruins your experience in deep Oaken. And I know we've all ran into that one person. I've most definitely ran into that one person. In overworld as well, as well as too, like just just run into that one person that just that just makes that just makes deep Oaken just hard to play. Just makes deep Oaken just a very unfun place for me. You feel me, so yeah. The eighth thing that has happened to all deep Oaken players is when you're just doing a 1v1 somebody, you know, you're trying to get this grip, you know, you're trying to make this easy, you know, get this easy dub that you know you can win. But then there's always gotta be like, just Lord have mercy. Like there's always gotta be this, that one guy that just tries to be a hero and saves the day and ruins the ones like, bro, nobody called you over here. Nobody told you to help me. Nobody told you to help him. Like, bro, let the ones finish and do what you gotta do, bro. I don't know why like niggas want to be heroes now like bro didn't last week you just gripped that freshie like bro don't help me or him you know don't be a hero today be a hero tomorrow the next week the next minute after the ones be a hero but not here bro the ninth thing that has happened to all deep poker players is when you're going to lap us you know you got your three lucky enchants that you got from your chest you know you walk into lap with so joyful you know what i'm saying just so happy yipping you know cheering around you feel me? And you go to Lapless, and then, you know, you give them your three enchants, you know, and you're like, I want that nation. I want that nation. I want that nation. I want, I want that nation. And then you actually get that nation. I, that, I know that feeling just, it's just so nice. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you just get that nation. You feel me? Like, you, you just wanted that enchant so bad, and you actually got it, like, in the chances that you probably could have just got, you feel me, wild. But instead, Lapless gave you that nation you feel me so it's like it's like gambling basically you know what I'm saying you won you know so you got your million dollars you know you're gonna walk up that shit like a real nigga a real G and you know what I'm saying you're gonna be that nigga just hitting everybody with that nation you feel me so yeah the final thing that has happened to all deep Oaken players is getting hit by the meanest combo by a player like the nigga block breaks you then he spine cuts you, then uppercuts you, then hits you with rising wind, and then uppercuts your ass again, and then send your ass to that fucking ground, and then lands that radiant dawn on you. And then your your HP is just gone. You know, you just lost three bars. And then he re he rinses and repeats and hit the same shit. You know what I'm saying? Cause if it ain't broken, don't fix it. So he hits you with that mean combo again, and then nigga, you're done. All he needs is two combos, and then your, your HP's gone. No way to counter. You feel me? Especially if you got that collapsed lunge, talent, and he block broke you. Like, shit, man. Like, I know if everybody's been hit with that mean combo, you feel me? And just make you go and look in that mirror and be like, shit, should I quit deep poking? It just gets you thinking, man. Like, am I some shit? Am I some ass? You feel me? So, yeah. Those are the 10 things that has happened to all Deep Woken players. Y'all let me know what I've missed. You feel me? Let me know what, you, what has happened to you that I didn't add into the video. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like, subscribe, and have a nice day.